Okay then. So today we're gonna to talk about electricity. It is basically a quick review of the unit for my final which I don't know when, though I know it's something sweet. So okay. We all know what electricity is. It's basically what power is saying. So but so to break down electricity, we have two types of circuits. So we have a circuit that looks like this. And a circuit that looks like this. Okay. This one is a parallel circuit. Meaning it has two pathways. So if I take this one out, it's going to be the circuit's still going to go. This one's a series circuit. So, series. Okay. It's backwards, but whatever. I don't feel like running backwards. So, with that, you have and people put lines for the sources right here, like the boxes. I use box like I like my teacher uses lines, but me I'm adding H E and I really like the lines. So what a circuit contains is a power source. So contents of a circuit let's just put that contents of a circuit let me put that contents of a circuit is main, like one of the main things is a power source and Power source, resistors, which allow, which block the current, like a light switch. Like when you flip the switch on, it's going to allow the current to go, like flow. And when you cut the switch off, it stops the current, like blocks the current. And you have wire, which really means conductor but and like really you got anything to a circuit resistor switch like there's a bunch of stuff for a circuit light like light bulbs and stuff but really that's pretty much it light so you're probably wondering okay after we have all that and we know like two types of circuits what a resistor does and what I mean we kinda know what a resistor does and we know what a switch does now we're wondering alright like voltage is easy like how much voltage it is like that's basically like voltage now we're gonna learn about like now let's talk about now we're gonna talk about how to calculate circuits and what I mean by that is we're going to talk about like, I'm going to talk about how we, how to calculate the power of the circuit, which is the voltage and the current and voltage draw, but I'm not real good at it, but I like, 
I can show it. So first is voltage. Cause really like some questions merely ask how much the voltage is. And that's like that's easy. You need to calculate how many power sources there are and what the numbers say. Like a battery has six volts. Like you can have one six volt battery. And then the total circuit's gonna have a current of a voltage of six volts. So basically we have a six volt fat battery, like you basically add numbers above power source. So what I mean by that, so what I mean by that is, you see these two boxes right here, that I say that are my batteries, well for a series we're going to put 6 volts on top, and 6 volts right here, on the parallel. So that means, there's one 6 volt battery, and another 6 volt battery right here. If there was two 6 volt batteries, they'll be separate. And also, I like the boxes because I can half in and say, alright, this is this, this is this. Okay, you need to see add the numbers above that. And if there's only one number of it, then that's the total circuit. Or voltage. Then the current is rather. But after the current, you need to calculate the resistors. What the resistors are, are the things that allow the current to flow. Like the light bulbs, the switch, all that good stuff. Okay. Yeah? Clear. What is it? Clear. 